Hey everyone, James at fatfinger.io. I'm going to ask you the most important question in operations, which is do you know if your people are doing their job correctly and safely every time? If the answer is no and you can't tell uh, yourself that or show your uh, team that in real time, did they do their job correctly and safely every time, then listen up. So we help enterprises, everyone from Exxon to Tallgrass to Power Pacific, every, um, enterprises from the largest in the world down to small businesses um, answer this question. We do that by empowering the frontline person to create digital change. So we're behind the camera here. We call them Bob. Bob is taking all of their standard operating procedures on how they do their work correctly and safely every time, and they're digitizing them by just dragging and dropping. These are not IT people. These are subject matter experts on the front lines who know their job, and they are just simply dragging and dropping and creating workflow automation so that they have their content at their fingertips and can capture the data while they're working to show that they've done their job correctly and safely every time. As you see here, these are old um, safety, asset inspections, operator rounds, you name it, there's thousands of procedures in, a, um, in, a, uh, you know, in operations. So we do this through four easy steps, which one I just showed you, how do you basically create apps or workflows um, and making it really easy to go digital. That's the first. The next is just through simplicity on any device, iPhone, iPad, Android, desktop. They have the content at their fingertips, whether it's training material, step-by-step -step instructions, field data capture. Um, it's all there on every device that works offline. Then how do you automate steps? So th certain uh, steps are uh, uh, automated or kicked off based on what is being done in operations, tasks assigned, and so essentially that no balls are being dropped or work gets missed and how to streamlining that and automating as many steps as possible. And then lastly, how do you generate uh, insights using the data flowing through your workflows using AI and uh, to identify bottlenecks and further again improve the operations and so I'll give you a quick demo on how that how that's achieved on the platform it's how fat finger works right hand side is what your operator might see from their uh, mobile device left hand side are a bunch of pre-made elements and you simply drag and drag and drop those onto here so first for a safety inspection we'll have a training on a video of how to do that Maybe if they want to walk up to an asset and scan it to kick off the workflow, they can do that or bring up the content that is specific to that area that they're working. Maybe they want to take a photo of the inspection they're doing, have a yes, no to make sure that it's safe to use, multiple choice, and a comment box with a signature. So is it safe? Risk level. And comments with a signature and maybe an approval section for the manager to sign off um, when needed. And so as you see, that app is being created, training video, is it safe, yes, no, photo, risk level, comment, signature, approvals. We hit save and now you can deploy this uh, workflow across your organization as easy as that. So imagine any type of procedure um, that is important for your people to do work correctly and safely every time. You can quickly put it onto Fatfinger, deploy it across your organization. Having that real-time data flow through your um, through your organization to see where the bottlenecks are, where where um, things are going around um, happening around you geospatially, and then if you're wanting to plugging in systems like uh, Microsoft Power BI, Snowflake. Um, SAP, etc. Um, so if you want to learn more or give it a try, just go to fatfinger.io. You can uh, schedule a call or give the uh, free trial a go. Thanks, everyone.